Hi, my name is Martin and today I'm going to show you the brand new NUX MG30 Versatile model. I'm really proud NUX invited me to be one of the first to show you their brand new model. And although it's not released yet, the nice folks at NUX allowed me to do an unboxing video with my first impressions. And like I said, I'm going to produce a couple of videos with the unit in a little series where I'm going to show you all the factory presets, the looper function, how I created my own factory presets, which are on the unit. And I'm so proud NUX invited me to do so. I hope you like those presets. But this video is all about the unboxing and first impressions. Okay, an unboxing now. When will it be announced, released? They told me end of February, beginning of March. So, before we actually start unboxing the MG30 from NUX, if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you won't miss any of the upcoming NUX MG30 videos and of course some of my other demos, um, lessons, fun stuff, whatsoever. Really appreciate, helps the channel a lot. Thank you. So, without further ado, Let's unbox the brand new MG30 from NUX. Let's see what we got here. So, the NUX MG30. Actually, it's quite heavy. It's 1.5 kilograms, which is 3.3 pounds. And now, let's unbox it. So, here we go. What does it say? What's in the box? MG30, one power adapter, one cable, a dual foot switch and a USB cable, which is quite nice because most of the units today don't come with an extra USB cable. Awesome. So, we have the actual manual with all the features, how to set it up and also in Chinese. Okay, but I won't read that now because I really want to see how intuitive the MG30 is. Here is the actual unit okay really nice let's open that up so here it is it looks just awesome it has is it plastic that's definitely not plastic got some rubber feet on it really nice here is the four inch LCD color display let's have a look at this side So, what do we got? The input, auxiliary in, headphone out, send and return, which is really nice to have for maybe the 4 cable method or integrating your favorite analog pedal. The outputs in stereo, left and right expression pedal, input and USB which I read now functions not only as a connection to the computer for the QuickTone um, software, but now it's also a real audio interface. The 9V DC input and an on-off switch. Really nice. Super smooth, yeah. 
the encoder wheel. What do we have here? The master. It feels absolutely high quality. It has nothing to do with the MG300. It has the perfect weight. Awesome. So let's see, what else do we got? We got a dual foot switch. How cool is that? I didn't know that comes with the unit. Now that's nice. That's really nice. I think you actually can plug this into the MG30. Nice latching. You can see here it's saying latch open and close. Passive is close mode, A and B. Really nice to have, but like I said, I'm going to show you in another video how to fully integrate this unit and operate with the MG30. This is the dedicated owner's manual. Nice, okay, what else do we got? have our 9 volt standard L cable power plug. So really nice, you can switch change adapters when you're in another country. So let's unscrew this one here to see how long this cable actually is. Oh yes, that's definitely over one meter. Nice again. So, something else in the box. Oh yes, something else. So, what is it? Ah, very nice. Ah, this is the stereo TRS cable for the little foot switch that came with the unit. Very nice. And the USB cable with, with the kind of a micro USB on one side and on the other your standard USB plug. I think it's also yeah, it's also with a nice length. I think again one about one meter. So I think that's it for the unit. And now Let's and power it up. Wow, it's actually already on. Nice. So, what do we got? Preset number one the good old JC120. Let's see what we got turn some knobs high deluxe reverb baseman tweet deluxe twin reverb okay 
And like I said, I'm going to make a dedicated factory presets playthrough video. What do we got here? Ah, that's amp on and off and impulse on and off. You can see here the impulse block and the amp block. We can, ah, we can move the direction here, okay. Get the time, get the control tab, yeah. Let's go to the global menu. And here we got an amp, yeah. And we can dial, it feels really, really nice. Um, everything is, oh, here we got the IR. We can choose between the caps, really nice. Really nice. Here we can choose the mics, some new mans, ribbon mics, condenser mics, the good old SM75. We can choose the positions. Oh, that's nice. From the mic center, middle, and edge. We also, what can kind of else can we do? Okay. And there we go global again. I now switched on the comp. And now we should navigate until we are. Ah. Here we have our comp. Okay, comp studio comp. Three compressions. Let's turn on an effect here. What have we got? Oh, here's, no, here's a noise gate. Ah, now it's on. Sensitivity, decay. Ah, it's the amp one. Now let's see what effects we got. Distortion plus an RC boost. AC boost, distortion one. I hope you can see that. Uh -huh. T screamer, blues driver, morning drive, a red, Killy crunch, a muff, Killy katana boost. Awesome to have. Yeah, really, really nice. You saw the amps, Viper King, rectifier, everything you need. 25. I think 25 models, base models also, yeah, and acoustic amp, very nice. We have EQ, 6 band EQ, 10 band EQ, parametric EQ, wow, that's really, really impressive. Let's turn on some, here's our send and return block, or we can send, I think, the send level and the return level awesome and here are our mods tremolo rotary harmonist univibe tc face flangers detunes chorus can add subdivisions yeah the depth intense it it feels so great. Digital delays, tape echo, reverse pan, dual time. Oh, they're all in dual time. I actually did a um, demo of this pedal. Really awesome. You have to check that one out. And last but not least, the reverbs studio, lexicon reverb, plate reverb, spring reverb. Shimmer, awesome, yeah. Room, it feels really nice, really nice. So let's have a look at the tuner. Here's the tuner, okay. We can choose, 
Gitarre, Chromatic, die Hertz. Ja. If it's muted or not. Like you see, I didn't read the manual at all. It's just um, some knob fiddling. Um, and yeah, really, really great. Double tap. That's great. We have a looper section. I think I have to press both. Nope. <laughs> and yeah, what else? Um, I mean, here is the manual again. Um, it's absolutely a fantastic unit. Um, I hope you could see that all. Really, really nice unit. Um, not some Chinese crap. No, no, it's this at 300 euros is unbelievable. Unbelievable. Okay, that's it for today's video. The unboxing. I hope you liked my little unboxing video. Stay tuned for the upcoming demos, which will get much more into depth and details. And yeah, if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell, so you definitely won't miss the other MG30 videos that are coming very soon. And if not, as soon as possible as it is released. Yeah, thanks for watching. That's it for today. See you next time. Bye.